In the meantime, the bitter cold temperature is causing other problems today, this time in some people's homes. Pipes are freezing, causing some to burst. MTN's Cody Boyer found one of several who experienced what happens next firsthand. The alarms started going off. The sound of alarms rang through Samantha's townhome yesterday. Water rushing out of her neighbor's second floor windows. A sight she's seen before, like in this video she captured on New Year's Day. It can cause a lot of damage, not just physical, but emotional damage. Bozeman City Water and Sewer Operations Superintendent John Alston says Samantha is not alone. We're starting to get more calls, um, especially with this dip that we just took in the last few days. We went to a house the other day that got totally flooded and it's thermostat was down to 55. He adds situations like Samantha's can leave costly damage. We've seen several houses that have been uh, damaged severely with water um, and uh, one the window was left open. The other one the heat was down. Um, I'm thinking that we're going to see quite a bit of damage when it starts to warm up. Alston says it is extremely important in the case of an impending situation with your water to know how to shut it off and where to shut it off quickly. It's near the meter and all it takes is a quarter turn to make sure you can avoid the worst. If you see your own breath in the area of your water meter, you are in imminent danger. He says being proactive, leaving sink doors open to expose pipes and using tools like hair dryers, not an open flame, can make a difference. For Samantha, it's a waiting game. It's a ticking time bomb, I feel like, for us until things can get fixed. We reached out to Larkspur Commons to see how the fix was coming along. They have not yet responded. In Bozeman, Cody Boyer, MTN News. And for more tips from the city of Bozeman on how to prevent your pipes from freezing or to find help, you can head to our website.